The connection between St. Lucia and Martinique has been carefully scrutinized by French Ambassador His Excellency Philippe Arcana during a summary of the 2019 initiative of the integrated French as a language of exchanges. Arcana drove home the point the need to bolster ties between Martinique and St. Lucia. But there are not so many relations. Uh, there is no business between the, uh, uh, the two islands and there is no real connections. Martinique has more connections with France mainland than it has with St. Lucia. And I'm sure St. Lucia has more connections with the United States and the UK than it has with uh, Martinique. And it's only 30 kilometers. Inspired by the theme for St. Lucia's 41st independence anniversary, his Excellency Arcana says now is the time for both islands to come together. Better future, it means more opportunities, it means more prosperity in the, uh, in the Caribbean. It means also something very important to stop brain drain, because brain drain is killing St. Lucia, it is killing all the Caribbean countries. and as it is killing Martinique and, uh, and Guadeloupe. It's a real problem. We want also to live in a better environment and we want to have a better life, healthy life, uh, which uh, means the possibility to go to the doctor whenever you want. The ambassador notes efforts have already been made on the environmental front in the Replast program. The other program aimed at bringing the two islands together is the I Feel initiative, a two-year challenge ending in December of 2020. You could think it's a program about language, about French language. Actually, it's not that. It's really more, uh, more than that. It's uh, something about created opportunities, uh, promoting exchanges in the Caribbean, uh, promoting education and promoting culture. The I Feel program will promote exchange for modern language teaching assistance, promote 25 guests from 12 different countries, including artistic mentors, and the launch of an entrepreneurial component surrounding a theme of sustainable development. Sula Jalfred, HTS News Force.